Hello, I'm Sean Thomas and I'm poet in residence for Ashdown Forest and I'd like to introduce you to my new collection Ashdown which is published by Paikakariki Press that's www.paikakarikipress.com Now my collection explores my long relationship with Ashdown Forest and many of the of the poems are about childhood and uh, youth but they're also about nature writing and and walking and um, and how we connect to our surroundings. They run through one year from January to January, but in in doing so they combine they they, they pick up on many years. Um, they bring lots of different um, experiences together. And I'm going to begin with a poem from January. This is Hind Leap. Winter's thrown a grey net over the day. It's caught moss-felted trees, inevitable mud, and the rags of rooks' nests. We used to come here all the time when I was a kid. We had picnics and spotted the place with Dalmatians, who stole our sandwiches and rolled in fox. Now the colours have faded, Winter storms have spread branches. The floor is a miniature forest. Twigs stick up, and I'm a giant squelching through. I follow path rivers down till I reach the valley and the small stream that's almost clear, but orange bottomed chaley beat, like it's fed by rusty pipes. I've no clue where I am. Off in the way, I leave the car park full of confidence till I reach the place that asks, what if you never get back? I sit on the stream's side in cold January leaves and write about loss. Water flits beneath the bridge. There's a sieve's worth of sunlight and the trees are dripping. But the path's turn is mine too. I've a cold bottom and the birds know who I am. I'm the mouth of the stream. The stream stands up, climbs the hill.